Probiotics, I, I guess uh, most people, when they think probiotic, their mind goes to yogurt. This is what people are familiar with. Yogurt is something that has live intestinal bacteria. So when they are eating yogurt, they're thinking probiotic, it's going to my intestinal tract, that's where the benefit will be. Um, what we're particularly interested in now, in the new age, if you like, of probiotics is oral probiotic, meaning probiotic that really colonizes, stops, attaches right at the beginning of the intestinal tract, which is in the mouth. So by taking K12, we're looking at acquiring friendly bacteria that will attach and grow, set up family, and do a good job right at the very beginning of the intestinal tract where most of the entry of nasty bacteria occurs, we want to have them intercepted there in the oral cavity by K12, present uh, in large numbers on the tongue. So how, how do you get K12 established in the mouth becomes the next question. And it's something that can take a little bit of time to build up the population and usually that means taking a course of gum, so taking a gum or something like that over a few days so the bacteria are released as you are sucking upon or chewing upon the gum into the saliva and from the saliva then the bacteria will bind to the various mucosal surfaces, the various surfaces of our mouth where the bacteria can firmly attach and start to replicate. That's what they're best at doing, replicating. Bacteria just love to multiply.